What is good, Josh Boy Dion Drill? We are back at another review for Bobby I Love You Prayer, episode two. Now, let me just say, let's just say, it's Zeus. It be Zeus for me. We're finna into episode three. And we just now get into the naming ceremony. Like, what? These episodes be dragging out. That's why I ain't getting review for baddies this week because, like, all they did was, oh, we had a honey mansion. Oh, let's sage the house down. Woo. Let's talk about this party we're going to. Yeah, yeah, we're going to a party, y'all. Yeah, yeah. It's Zeus. Zeus dragged out these scenes, and I hate this. I hate when they do these scenes like, okay, so, like, they had a cast members all meet up or, like, a good set, two or three. They were like, okay, so how do you feel about this? How do you feel about that? It just seems so fake and, like, so fake and, like, unauthentic because, like, People don't stop a conversation like that. Like, hey, just have genuine conversations. Just have somebody on camera and be like, so what's up? Oh, what's up? Like, how you doing? I'm doing good. Like, what you think about such and such? Like, let it flow like that. Don't be. So, how do you guys think? Because that ain't, that ain't real. That ain't real life, okay? And Zeus with these made up makeup scenes. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Okay. Get to Bobby. I love you. Prayer episode two. <sighs> now... I can say, like, this episode wasn't bad, but it's for the simple fact that it drags. Like, we should have already had this, we should already had this naming ceremony. We should have already been a challenge. Like, I don't know how to feel about the season. It's entertaining, but, like, God damn, can we get some more? Can we get... <sighs> Zeus. It'd be Zeus for me, okay? Okay. So... We start this episode with Cash and Crush. They talking about the night previously before, um, how Demetri had them messed up, whatever the case may be. It wasn't really talking about much. I'm gonna talk, I'm gonna only talk about the important stuff in this episode. Okay, okay. Um, next scene we get Grandy, um, Zachariah, the do all the goes, the dark scene, do all the goes. Look good. Um, and Demetri. And we get the other dude, Mason. They all talking about what happened the night before as well. And I respect it because I, what I respect is Grandy said, you know, from here on out, I'm going to have a Dimitri back. Even though he be starting, I'm going to have his back. So that's all that matters. Like, I was like, okay, Grandy. Okay, Grandy. You know, look good. You know, he's standing up for somebody. Okay, big Grandy. Okay, I see you, boy. Like, okay, and then after that, cause you know, it was like two scenes of them just talking about the night before or whatever. Oh, <laughs> before all that, like, let me rewind back. Um, Jeffrey Star and his ex, okay? Now, his ex is there. I don't know why his ex is there. I don't know if his intentions are good. And even Bobby said, like, he don't know his intentions are. And if you're in a relationship with somebody, you should know what their intentions are. Like... He has some sort of attention, whether it's fake intentions, whether it's TV time attention, whether it's he just want to do it for cloud attention. You should know what type of attention uh, he's giving you or that he wants. Like, it should never be a I don't know his vibes. Like, especially if y'all been together, you should you should definitely peep out his vibes for sure. OK, um, he's on this show and it's just like. He's talking about, yeah, you know, you mind, you know, where our room at? Like, let's go to our room. Let's do this. Let's do that. Da, da, da. Sir, what are your intentions like for real? Nobody knows his intentions. Like, why are you on the show? Is it, is it for TV cloud? Because I don't know if it's a TV or cloud or if it's really for Bobby because it's giving me a mix. I think he's really there for Bobby, but I don't know. People saying he's there for TV. I don't know. Okay. So, him and Bobby used to date or whatever. I don't know if they... They said they used to date. I know they did some OnlyFans videos together and stuff like that. I hope... I hope, like, this whole... Andre... Is that his name? Andre? I hope he's just not, like, this whole clout built on person because he did mess with Jeffree Star. I don't know. I really don't know about him, okay? Um, Bobby tells him he got to lay on the couch. Like, he got to uh, rest on the couch, okay? So, he rests on the couch. Okay. Next scene, the last scene of the episode, we get all these people outside. I don't feel like naming all these people. I don't even know how these people names. Okay, Jameson, Crush, Cash, uh, the the Dmetrics, whatever his name is, dude with all the tattoos and dreads. They all outside talking about the night before. 
I just thought the episode was just recapping the night before, to be honest. Y'all know how Zeus do, especially with baddies as well. They just recapping the night before. And uh, Jameson, I'm not going to lie. Jameson, I don't know. I don't, I don't understand half the conversation that was going on because Jameson, like, his accent and he be talking too fast. But it seemed like he be starting. Like, it's not even, he just kind of aggy to me. Like, he be starting these arguments. He be starting it. He argued with Andre. He argued with crush and i don't i couldn't really understand the argument like what what was being said like what was he saying Talk about you cabbage you you cabbage you garbage you garbage like cabbage you cabbage like cabbage like what i can understand shit he was saying like what the fuck is he saying <laughs> um crush called him a big bottom right it was that i hear like crush called him a bottom they're gonna have to clarify in the comments because i couldn't hear a goddamn thing over um Jameson acts in his voice, but she might James really be starting like Jameson. Like, what am I even worried about? You ain't nobody even calling you out. You up here, like, just starting. And then Crush get caught out for being on Jack. Um, during the show, while I was filming that, it is messed up. And like the white dude said, it takes one to know one. So, if you whoever saw he was on a dating site must be on a dating site too, which was right. Facts. And then we got this, this dude, um. The dude that said that he was on Jack, his name is Trail. I saw him on Twitter and stuff like that too. To my, I'ma tell Bobby. The, I, I hate the fact that he's feminine. Like I just wish he was like more manly, like Granny. Like he'll be more attractive if he was like that. Um, James and Andre get into it. Andre's like he's like, why don't you pick on somebody else's size, bro? Like da da da. They get into it. Andre, he tried to, he was like, don't get, nigga, that'd be your last time you get in my face. That'd be your last time you get in my face. Push him, they pushing each other. They saying, you know, Andre dunk him in the pool. <sighs> Crush got dunked in the pool. And he up here like, yeah, it's all good. No, that's embarrassing. Like, you should have got that pool me ready to fight. Like, that was embarrassing. Like, I was dunking in the pool. Um, Jameson just be starting. Seems like Jameson really be starting, y'all. This is my review of Bobby I Love You Period Episode 2. Um, make sure y'all clarify some things in the comments. Like, what was Jameson and Crush arguing about? Because I know Jameson was like, you on Jack selling this and that. But they just kept arguing. I couldn't understand nothing they were saying. Like, what was Crush calling Jameson the whole time? A bottom? Am I tripping or did he call him a big bottom? And like, yeah, y'all. Jameson was just starting. And I hope the season don't drag. But it seems like it's going to drag out. But this is network for you. All right, episode two, Bobby Lee Peer Review. Make sure I subscribe to my videos like this. I'm out. Peace.